Scalia with Cincy Chic, and I'm here with Lee Krumholtz with Krumholtz Jewelers in Montgomery. And we, this month, we are talking about a beautiful uh, piece that Lee made for a trade magazine. Do you want to tell me about the process that sure. how you came about it? Yes, sure. Um, I uh, I work with a uh, magazine called uh, Manufacturing Jewelers and Suppliers of America, mm -hmm. and uh, they asked for me to do a project where we were repurposing. Uh, gemstones and uh, used a process of computer-aided design and um, com uh, computer-aided machining um, to make a pendant. Um, so, um, so basically, you're wearing a pendant. Yes, it's gorgeous. It's gold on one side. Gold on one side, and silver on the other. Yeah, I love it. And are these sapphires here? They are sapphires, right? Yeah, I'm getting good. Yeah, <laughs> and really, the project was to show both the uh, CAD CAM version and the handmade version. So the handmade mm -hmm. side is completely made by hand in silver, uh, as my grandfather would have made uh, oh, in the yeah. early 1900s. So, yeah. um, so really, that was sort of the comparison mm -hmm. and to try to figure out um, method-wise which method is the most cost-effective, mm -hmm. especially with the price of materials, mm -hmm. uh, gold in particular today. So, so what did you find out? Which one was more cost-effective? Uh, the CAD CAM version uh, saves a little bit of money um, in the process just because of the oh. cost, the amount of time it takes mm -hmm. to do the other version. Wow, they're beautiful. And I didn't even realize until you said that, that it's really a very similar design um, on both sides. Uh, just one is gold and the other one is silver. And then these are repurposed diamonds right. as well. And um, uh, we uh, uh, realize uh, as a, a company that we can, we can minimize our carbon footprint a number of ways, uh, but it's really challenging to do much beyond a certain point. So we decided um, years ago uh, that a lot of the processes that we use, uh, including remodeling things for customers, um, selling antique jewelry, which we do, and, uh, and then developed another additional um, line that we call, or brand that we called uh, Renew Jewel, mm -hmm. that actually takes uh, existing uh, antique jewelry often that is worn out, can't be worn, and mm -hmm. repurpose what's in it into a new piece of jewelry that we then sell in our store under the brand name Renew Jewel. So well, this is a Renew yeah. Jewel pendant. Well, that's really neat because someone like me, I don't have years and years of a jewelry collection to bring into Lee and say, redesign all of these pieces into a beautiful new piece. Uh, this is some a way for me to be able to have a repurposed piece that's really special and unique, and I don't have to provide all of those items right up front so that's something really different not a lot of people have repurposed items in the store for you to purchase a lot of times that um, each custom piece is custom made per order uh, per customer so that's and what we, you mean. And we, we do this partly because we do have a good amount of customers who are sensitive about the ecological mm -hmm. uh, ramifications of mining and mm -hmm. blood diamonds and right. all sorts of things that, that unfortunately occur in the process of producing new materials. So for us, it's just a way of you know, providing uh, something for them that mm -hmm. you know, they wouldn't buy jewelry because of their sensitivity, and this gives them an option to do something that's different. Right, and you know what? Earth Day is coming up, so if you are eco-minded or you want to do something good for Mother Earth, come and see Lee, and he's got some renewed jewels for you that, like you mentioned, it's, it's better for the Earth to um, not be mining new uh, metals out of the Earth, and like you mentioned, some, uh, some of the other ramifications. So this is really good for not only you and your wardrobe, but also Mother Earth. So right. this is really great, and there's tons of information about Krumholtz and also their Renew Jewel program on their website, and which is? www.krumholtzjewelers.com, spelled K-R-O-M-B-H-O-L-Z-J-E-W-E-L-E-R-S.com. <laughs> little spelling bee for you. Yes. <laughs> all right, we'll check out the website and find out all about this and more, and we'll see you next month.